This morning, dozens of World War II and Korean War veterans are getting ready to depart on the trip of a lifetime. 10 News reporter Nate Holmes live at Lindbergh Field. Nate, this is such a special trip for these veterans. It is a very special trip, and I, talking to many of the veterans, they are just full of energy, excited, and ready to go. They have actually, as you can see behind me, it's a different scene from where we were 30 minutes ago because all of the veterans have made their way through the gate, so they will be ready. They're getting ready to take off uh, to their Southwest flight about 7 o'clock this morning. But joining me is Holly Schaffner with Honor Flight. Good morning. Good morning. Uh, so, Holly, um, I'm going on a flight. Hi, Holly, uh, just kind of tell us, you know, the, the excitement that surrounds these veterans being uh, being here and being around, you know, all of their, their comrades. Well, you saw it today. I mean, those smiles are just ear to ear. And can you imagine how much bigger they're going to get over the weekend when they just see all of the memorials that were built for their service and sacrifice? And then tell us a little bit about what they will be doing once they uh, land. Yeah, once they land, we'll um, have a little bit of a welcome there at BWI Airport, and they think that that is the greatest thing ever. And then I whisper to the guardians, I say, but wait till we get back to San Diego. <laughs> so um, that's going to be at Baltimore, and then tomorrow is a big day for them. We go to the World War II Memorial, the Lincoln Korea, Vietnam Memorials. We go to the Marine Corps Memorial, Arlington National Cemetery to see Changing of the Guard, and the Navy Yard Museum. And then uh, due to funding, not as many veterans were able to go on this flight, but we had a little saving grace. Yes, if you can believe it, normally we take 80 veterans, but unfortunately we only had enough money for 64 for this flight when we had over 100 that were waiting on our list. And thank goodness for Southwest Airlines because they gave vouchers to all of our uh, World War II and Korea veterans. Otherwise, uh, this trip would not be happening. Well, thank you so much. As you, as we mentioned, the veterans have made their way through security through TSA, and they will be they're waiting for their next flight. So they'll be boarding in about uh, 30, 40 minutes or so. But we'll be going behind the gate and watching them as they board their flight. But it's definitely a great experience to be out here with them and just sharing all their stories. Live at Lindbergh Field, Nate Holmes, 10 News.